Oh, it's just sitting here waiting for me. Convenient. Okay, I think I'm gonna go to the back and work my way forward today. Driving skills are not the best today, but we are in. And I was just gonna go straight to the back, work my way forward, try not to make you sick. We got a lot going on. Ooh, those are good too. Little Hawaiian party. Okay, let's get to the back and see what we can find back here. And not run anyone over. It looks like at the back we have glass today. I was also told by the cashier that they tend to put out glass on Sundays, which is a day I never come. Not that I'm a huge breakable glass person, but it is good to keep in mind if I'm ever looking for it. Oh, hey, look at that. Um, in my video where I went to the Good Stuff Thrift Store, these were there. I remember them. Wedgwood. A little creamer. Might get that. Oh, NBC. Right? NBC? I'm pretty sure. Avalon, France, Limoges. We got a big old ship. Probably go for about 10. So we're gonna leave those. Going.
your lantern. Oh, okay. There is a spider, but it's dead. Eaten? Eat on? Ikea? These can be expensive. Sun pack. Oh, do I? I'll look it up. Um, 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 I saw these and I have to get them. They are five dollars each. But we're going to get those. What 
to me see if there's any more. Oh, that looks like fancy art. Five dollars. Someone put their puzzle in a frame. Hmm. Oh, there it's signed. Harry Wells. I'll look that up. Snow-capped peaks. This is a print, it looks like, anyway. Okay, I'm gonna look up Harry Wells and see if he's famous. This is a print also. It's not an actual painting. Okay, I did like a quick search on Harry Wells. Couldn't find a ton, so I left that one. I'm not trying to get a lot of art right now, so because I keep continuing to not post it which is my own fault. But um, I'm gonna leave that one since I couldn't really find much on him. of a heart or something? Cookies for Santa. sale for like 45 this one very sad condition and it's like yellowed Like some, it's like insanely broken everywhere. But it looks like from like the Bradford Exchange. One. I'm gonna have to figure it out here. 
kids artwork which is kind of sad actually <laughs> ephemera hopefully that's fine like they kept her test scores and everything they were very nice parents I'm gonna get that too Little woodsy. I don't know what that means.
looks very suspicious under that tape. Maybe they didn't like the noise he made? Painted Nippon. which VHSs are worth it and which aren't. me about this and it is not ooh, not worth getting evidently it needs a plate here and this uh, model is not the best so that helps I don't have to look it up evidently there was a fire grill but for employees only 
the rest of us can just figure it out. There's like a whole bunch of these. This one it looks like it's not open. out of that. dog got it
wonder if you could replace the batteries. Donate an ironing board, and they said no because no one irons their clothes anymore.
wasn't expecting that. And I'm gonna put it up here. Kind of my breakable. all their blue row. Ooh, someone barfed on it too or something.
่าวนะครับThe stars above shirt. Um, it goes for about five to ten. Next is a collab with Target. Some of these can go for a decent amount. It is Kika Vargas Target. Um, Goodwill wanted ten dollars. It is a really cute sweater, uh, but it usually will go for about twenty-five, twenty-seven new. So used, obviously less than that, and it's heavy. So I put that back. And then these cargo shorts, Jordan Craig, those go for about 15 or so. So I threw those back as well. Gentlemen? Hmm. I wonder if there's another one. I have one of those at the bottom. That is why I'm not digging for it. spider. Okay, here is what we ended up with. Pretty small amount, but that has been my goal to be more picky. So I'm definitely trying. So let's go through all of this. First, we have a vintage kids little romper like circus themed, I think. Little discoloration there. Me and... Me... Oh, and the gang. I thought it said me and me gang. 18 months made in Taiwan. 
got that. Next is street faded size medium, like a bright green yellow watermelon print men's shirt button down. Um, these go for okay, um, but I think because of the print, it'll do decent, so I got that. Oh, I was gonna look this up. Um, this is Pleasant Blue Willies. I have no idea. Again, I was gonna look it up. But it looks like a double zip. And the zippers are branded, which is usually a good sign. Um, but this is size medium, and it's like a sweater hoodie. Next, this is Cossack, some kind of pajama pants, leisure pants, size 26-28. Cossack is Lane Bryant's lingerie sleepwear line. But it's a nice tropical print. Next is a Disney like a light purple, super soft, kind of like a hoodie, but like a lounge hoodie that you can wear when you're going to bed. Um, it is size, size mystery. I would say a smaller medium, maybe, but it's in good condition. A scarf, a bright blue floral scarf with some butterflies somewhere. I saw a butterfly. Anyways, nice scarf and lightweight. Next is, I don't, there was like a ton of these, but some of them were open. Hopscotch comes with chalk, bean bake, and instructions. And it doesn't look like it was open. And there's something in there, so. I'm gonna grab that. Next is a vintage travel bag. I love vintage luggage, but it's hard to sell because it's so heavy and large to ship. But this is pretty compact. Um, and it's a, like a mustardy yellow. It needs a little bit of cleaning but what brand are you? Yeah. I'll probably do a Google Lens and find the brand. Next is a big lot of vintage ephemera cards. Um, they are wrote on, but the graphics are too fun to not get. I tried to get as many as I could. There was some like little booklets in there. A coloring book. But just like a large pile of ephemera. So I got all of that. Then I got this. I don't know if this is cool or however you say it. Um, but I love it. It's vintage flower scene. Five dollars on that one. And then there was another one. Which is also flowers, blue flowers, and a fence post. Also five dollars. So, we're gonna get those two. Even if I just found these today, I would have been super happy. Um, they're going to be slightly a pain to ship, but probably worth it. Okay. And then I got some glass. I'm going to hang this on the end to look it up. Oh, and I found this super adorable cat. His leg is slightly coming unglued, but I love him. Her. Whatever very cute. Uh, so getting that. These I was also going to look up. I couldn't find the brand, but they looked 
decent quality. It's like a workout pant, size medium. So I'll probably look up the RN number and see what brand it is. It's a mystery brand right now. Next is a little mini milk jug, half pint liquid sealed. Little glass jug. And a very like lightweight blue vase. It needs a cleaning, but there's a little etching on it. So we're getting that. A vintage mug. I'm pretty sure this is NBC. Pretty sure. Um, but yeah, pretty good condition. The colors look pretty good, not super faded. Next is a whiskey, possibly, glass. It is the Order of Gentlemen. I could only find one, though. Next is a little mini calculator. I might put this back. It is vintage, but if I can't replace the batteries, which I'm not super sure I can, then it's just like a fun little display piece. So I might be putting that back. Next is a Wedgwood Little Creamer. No chip. I don't think. Oh wait, yeah. There's a chip. Right there. So we might put this fella back in a little crack there. If it had the sugar, um, I probably would just get it even though it has a crack, but being that I just have the single little creamer, I'll probably put that back. Okay, and last. not to break everything is a Tory Burch butterfly shirt. It's inside out right now, but you kind of get the idea. Um, so that was a really good find. That will, oh, it's 100% silk too. Size small. Um, probably get a good amount for that, so happy finding that. So we're gonna look these few things up, make sure I want them, and then I will check out, probably. All my stuff is listed on eBay, Poshmark, and Mercari in order, usually, of when I buy it. I tend to go in spurts of what I post, so I'll do a bunch of clothes, a bunch of handbags, a bunch of shoes, so I kind of do that, but it still kind of goes in order of what I buy. But if you could give the video a thumbs up, it would be appreciated. And we will be digging more soon and probably going to some retail Goodwills as well. Um, I also have about three to four bins locations within an hour and a half of where I live. So I may branch out and just kind of do a, a little trip to see which one's the best. So that's on my plate for the future, but in the meantime, we will see you later. Bye.